I'm not going to be pushed around. Dan Zerath owns Jackson's Blue Ribbon Pub in Wauwatosa. They've complied with the governor's stay-at-home order so far, but come May 1st, he says that's going to change. A lot of my employees, they're hurting. I've had to borrow money to several employees, and it's just bad right now, and we just need to reopen up our economy. He says the governor's extension of the order until May 26th is unfair. We're in America, yes, you should have a choice. Zerath says choosing to open up his doors on May 1st has little to do with money. As a matter of fact, when I open up, I'm going to lose money. I'm doing this to make a point. They're taking rights from us, and they have no right to do that. That's no longer just a decision that affects him that has a dangerous impact on our community. Jacob Flum is a member of the Facebook group Defeat Right to Work in Wisconsin. He's against Zerath's plans to open sooner. It's not only dangerous, but it's insulting to our frontline healthcare workers that are fighting this virus. Yes, it's very serious. People are dying, but it just does not constitute shutting down an entire nation that was thriving and doing so well. Despite online criticism, Zerath says he's going to be careful, enforce social distancing, and people will be able to dine in come May 1st. If you want to stay at home, my God, this is America. Stay at home. You have every right to, but for the people that are tired of it and want to come out and have a meal by me, please do. You have that right. In Wauwatosa, Sarah Tamer, WISN 12 News. Now, Wauwatosa police say if or when a business plans to open on May 1st, police would address the specific situation at that time. Tonight, the Tavern League of Wisconsin released a statement calling for a soft reopening of the state's taverns, restaurants, and supper clubs by May 1st.